uh, mr aditya hearty congratulations on securing all india rank number 4 in civil engineering branch in the gate examination 2022 thank you sir yeah uh, mr aditya you please tell us what type of coaching program that you have availed from our ace engineering academy so actually i have availed uh, the online test series from ace institute so i was a part of that series right very good so you are the uh, person who have availed our uh, online test series yes, uh, aditya can you please uh, elaborate how our ace academy online test series helped you in securing such a good rank in the gate examination so the ace uh, online, uh, online test was really was really was really very good because uh, it helped me to uh, to check my mistakes and to correct my mistakes that was uh, that i was committing again and again so it really helped me to get my rank that i got this year so it was really really very well designed test series that was very good very good uh, aditya in our yes test series there are so many exams almost more than 100 exams are there and tests yes. are there like uh, yes. topic wise subject wise and yes. also group of the subjects and also full length mock is there so yes. how could you schedule your preparation uh, with this uh, so many tests and all sir first i used to revise my notes that i prepared myself so after revising my notes i used to go and solve the first from the basic ones and uh, then i uh, after eventually after taking the uh, basic test then i would go for a, a full length test so it will it will eventually uh, boost boost my speed if if i go just directly on the directly on the advanced test or the full length full length test it will not be much helpful first you uh, we should always take from the basic step so the basic uh, test actually helped me in getting uh, in getting my uh, mistakes correct and then i eventually uh, went on to scoring in higher high, higher and higher in the uh, full length test so so it was a really good experience for, for me to get that test and eventually i it helped me to get my scores to an high level sir okay very good aditya see totally how many tests you would have taken approximately 90% or 80% of the tests available in our academy so i have taken uh, i don't remember but uh, i have taken most of the tests in the very good test series okay in all this test especially in the uh, full length mock test and all where mm-hmm. you used to stand rank wise mr aditya sir first uh, uh, initially the rank was not good uh, i was not getting a good rank in the initial test but uh, after my after I, i was correcting my mistakes and eventually the the rank came closer to like uh within 20 30 i was getting and then eventually in the final test also i was i got a all india rank score so it was a very good experience. i think this will be a, a what you call a good motivation for the mm-hmm. many aspirants of the gate examination mm-hmm. because uh, some yes. students know when they take the uh, what mm-hmm. you call the mock test without preparation the moment they see their uh, low marks etc they get disappointed yes. so from your uh, experience one should understand that initially we may get but you have to work up on them slowly you will improve your rank right yes sir yes. this is what the student have to observe you can't yes. build everything overnight you need to have patience right once yes, you work correct. systematically i think after some time you will be able to reach the top level yes so, very good very good aditya uh, aditya you please tell us about your educational background and when did you pass out okay sir uh, actually i am from uh, kolkata sir and i did my btech uh, in civil engineering from iit guwahati in 2021 and then uh, i was pre- uh, preparing i was self self preparing uh, for the gate and esc exam so i re- i wrote both the exams uh, in this year itself and uh, in one i got a success and for the second one for esc i i am prepare i am uh, ex- expecting the result will be out soon yes so, yes so we wish that you will be successful in the engineering series exam also yes. that is hope the best uh, aditya you said that you have completed the degree in the 2021 right yes sir so you would have given this gate examination last year also yes sir, i have given this exam in last year also but uh, i couldn't fetch a good rank last year uh, i was i was getting around uh, rank around 1500 so i thought this rank wouldn't fetch me any psu or any job or uh, and uh, mtech was not my plan so, so i was planning to get into a good psu so i thought of 
giving uh, one more attempt this year. So now I got a All India rank for this year. Right. Too. Very good, Aditya. This is not something uncommon because we have been observing the students when the student uh, write the gate exam, which may be third year or fourth year, it's in the first attempt because of lack of preparation and so many reasons. They may not get such a good rank, but when they took the same gate exam in the second attempt, I think many, most of them preparation they are able to crack this one. Right, very good. Mm -hmm. Aditya, can you please uh, tell us uh, to your juniors what mistakes that you did in the last attempt and what improvement you have made in the last year and how you are able to get this year fourth rank compared to last year? What changes you have made? Can you please narrate something about this? The students mm -hmm. will get benefit out of this uh, interview. So actually, in the last attempt in 2021, when I was uh, attempting the paper, actually my prepar preparation was good in the last last year itself. But the problem was uh, when I attempted the paper in 2021, in in the, in the starting of like four to five questions, was, I was not able to uh, get to the get to the answer of like initial four to five questions. So actually, it demotivated me at that time. My confidence was lost at that time. So and I also wasted a lot of time in that in that part itself so but this time this time i had my strategy that i won't be wasting my time in uh, in the long question sir it is it is like uh, we will get some questions like four to five questions that will be hard but it will be tough for everybody so yes. we shouldn't it's just we shouldn't waste our time in those questions that is the most that is the most important part uh, for the gate exam because four to five questions will definitely be, will be there uh, which will be tough uh, but that will be tough for everyone so we have to and we have to just observe that uh, this question is tough if if it is tough then we have to just leave for for some time if if we are able to get all the questions if we are able to attempt all the questions then in the last we can attempt those four to five questions and uh, if if uh, if we if we can uh, if time will permit then we can get those four to five difficult questions but we are the but, but the most important part is first we should attempt all the questions in one go if you are not able to get some questions, then we can leave that question because it will be hard for everybody. So first, we should we should uh, have a focus to attempt all the questions at least at least attempt one time all the questions. That will be beneficial for everyone. I would suggest this part. That so, yeah. okay. no mistake. Yeah, what I understand, last year and this year, your preparation was more or less equal. Yes. But thing is that your approach, your mental approach. strategy, this time it was something different. Yes. So that is how, right? So that's why the students have to observe that it is not just what you call your hard work and the preparation of the content of the uh, syllabus, what we have. Yes. You need to have some mental focus also, what to attempt, how to proceed in the examination, all and all, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Aditya, can you, yes, you need to have some strategy. So can you uh, a little bit elaborate your actual strategy on the day of examination, in the actual gate examination, in the three hours of time, 65 questions, where you have started, in what sequence you went on attempting the question? Sir, in this attempt, at, uh, because this was my second attempt, and now I've, I've already uh, learned from the mistake that I have committed in the last paper. So my strategy was simple, that to look first to attempt all the questions, at least see all the questions, uh, so I was like, uh, I was solving from the first question itself. And uh, and this year, like uh, the, in the second shift paper, the aptitude was aptitude part was easy. So from the first question I was solving, so the aptitude was the aptitude and mathematics part. I I solved like like in ten to fifteen minutes. I solved the ten questions of aptitude and mathematics. Then I after then after that I. Uh, I was solving the uh, technical question. So the, my strategy was simple, like to attempt all the questions in just first attempt all the questions. And if some like I was uh, I was also getting some two to three questions that were tough in the middle of it. So I was leaving those questions and I thought that I, I will be solving those questions in the last uh, in the, uh, after attempting all the questions. So and yes, it helped me because uh, it uh, it it was uh, I was not wasting much time on those questions on those difficult questions. So it helped me, and uh, I was like I attempted all the questions in like uh, in uh, in two in two hours. I attempted all the questions, like sixty five questions. I have attempted at least. I have seen all the questions. Not and after that, uh, in after the in in the last thirty minutes, I was last thirty to forty minutes. Forty minutes, I was uh, doing all those tough questions. I was attempting those tough questions in the last uh, forty minutes. So in uh, and in the tough questions, I also got some like two questions. I was able to solve in the last forty minutes. 
because this those questions were actually were tough but uh, because i had time in the last in the last uh, in the last 40 minutes so i attempted those questions and i totally i uh, out of 60 65 questions i attempted like 63 questions and uh, i got correct around 58 to 59 questions that were correct so it that fetched me a good mark so totally how many marks you have got so i was uh, getting like after normalization i've got a 94.22 90 94.22 94.2 marks right yes. what was the score and the uh, score was like 90 nine, uh, 987 sir 987 very good very good well done aditya well done right so the time was uh, well sufficient for you because we made yes. a rigorous practice well before yes. the time you could uh, solve all the questions there yes sir. right very good aditya aditya i have prepared any short notes something like this for your revision purpose yes i i had prepared some short notes uh, short notes could help uh, every aspirant like like uh, all the toppers uh, they uh, they used to give advice like uh, preparing a short notes because it will help in the re- in the revision part so i prepared like for each and every subject i prepared like two to two to like uh, for the important subject i have prepared like separate notebooks for for the uh, for, for the revision ones and for the very small subjects uh, for like building materials and irrigation these subjects i prepared like uh, very two to three uh, pages short notes uh, because this the, this uh, these subjects have don't don't have much weightage so i prepared like two to three short notes uh, two to three pages short notes so it would help everyone like every aspirant it could help uh, to revise in the last go so it would help everyone sir i would okay. suggest to have, to prepare some short notes yes yes right uh, i also know that this this short notes must be student specific right yes different students to write point, different yes. it styles be, it should be really very concise and very uh, to the point like it shouldn't have like uh, like uh, all the like all the theories and all it should have like very precise formula that you that you have solved from the previous questions so it would help it would help in the last revision. okay what was your short notes containing formula anything else beyond that so uh, mostly my formula uh, my short notes was comprising of formulas and uh, also uh, and also i have prepared a different notebook for my mistakes because i have given so many tests so uh, whenever i was getting some uh, difficult questions i was marking those questions and i was uh, writing those questions in a separate notebook so it helped me a lot in the uh, last in the last one month uh, just, uh, last one month uh, revision strategy because uh, in the last one last one month i was just doing my uh, test and revising and uh, and uh, actually i was seeing this uh, my mistakes notebook where i have written all my mistakes from the test series okay what i understand okay. apart from this short notes of the every technical subject you have also prepared another short notes containing the what you call the Only questions mistakes. where you did some mistakes in the mock exams yes okay i think this is also a good point the student have to notice this one not only short notes of the subjects better you maintain one short notes of the what you call questions where you went on doing mistakes so that we can improve over that right yes okay uh, aditya see uh, did you refer to any standard test books for this subjects preparation no so i have not referred much much textbook i have i have uh, uh, i have studied mostly from the coaching materials coaching materials itself because okay. it is sufficient for the gate exam yes, but if yes. you are like preparing for the esc and all then you will need some like if you can uh, we can refer some te- more textbook but for gate exam it is sufficient we can go only for the coaching material that is sufficient i think yes yes and one more thing uh, one more thing aditya you know for gate examination practice of the question bank is very very important right yes. so apart from this uh, coaching material question bank etc uh, what else do you have practice i think we might have also practice that previous years questions and solutions yes yes i have like uh, i have i have uh, gone through the previous question previous questions like four to five times i have gone uh, yeah. and uh, it was because like i i've memorized all the questions in the last <laughs> uh, in the last two months <laughs> so so previous years questions you have solved four to five times yes <clears throat> so to what action they have helped you in this uh, success mr aditya actually the previous year uh, previous year questions are the like the bible of any exam we can say uh, <laughs> previous <laughs> previous right. the previous year questions gives you an idea about like what kind of a question uh, what kind of question the it is who is preparing the paper they can they can give like uh, i was uh, i was like uh, I, i knew that this year it kharagpur would be preparing the paper so i uh, i mostly saw the last year questions that it kharagpur has made mm. so uh, so it helped me like just yes, uh, analyzing the questions it helped me to fetch some idea about the topics they could ask more 
and the where the weightage could be more it helped me to get uh, those points right right uh, well said aditya i think uh, most of the point that you have shared uh, through this uh, video i think they are very helpful to the uh, juniors those who are preparing for the gate examination so for all those aspirants i think this interview will be very very uh, useful i once again congratulate you mr aditya for securing the all india rank 4 in gate 2022 in swimming branch and also i wish you all uh, all the best in all your future endeavors thank you sir very god bless you aditya god bless you aditya thank you, thank you. take care right okay